Breaking news involving Seahawks has just been revealed, taking everyone by surprise. Our journalists have managed to obtain this valuable information. Speculation is running high and the club president is considering investing in this new featured player. However, before we discuss the details of the news, I kindly ask you to subscribe to the channel, aiming to surpass the number of subscribers of Green Bay Packers soon. With everyone's collaboration, we aim to become the main news channel, and then, guys in love with the Seahawks, I'm coming with an angry chat about a stop that can give our team an extra gas. Let's see if this news is at the pace we like. So check it out. Rookie cornerback Devin Witherspoon is hitting the ground running at a position we might not have expected. He's embracing the nickel challenge with gusto. So are you digging this vibe or not? Let's go. Although it was an unexpected move, Witherspoon is doing well at the nickel position in practice. He's connecting with the Seahawks defense and throwing himself headfirst into this new role. And hey, he even enjoyed the position pretty quickly. The guy showed that he's into it and that it's a game that fits his style. Do you like to see this willingness in the game, or do you think it's slow? And with Mike Jackson and Trey Brown also hitting the practice field, and Rick Woolen back in the fold, the Seahawks secondary has crazy depth. Remember the days of the Legion of Boom? And mind you, that's not to say the guys are on the level of Richard Sherman, Earl Thomas, and Cam Chancellor, but it's promising. The scheme now is to exploit Witherspoon's adaptation in the slot, where the technique is more complex, with assignments to cover running and other plays. And then Coach Carroll said he's fine with Witherspoon taking on this challenge, that he has the right stuff for it. Are you into it or not? Although he's not the biggest guy, Witherspoon doesn't shy away from the line. He likes to play physical, and that's key to staying closer to the line of scrimmage. Take this, Woolen said Witherspoon goes up like a linebacker, gets his hands dirty, sticks his foot in, you know? He doesn't care about size, he wants to hit and show he's got game. The coaching staff even called him out for this nickel roll, and he was up for it. Since receivers are in the slot more often these days, the ability to cover there is a huge advantage for a cornerback. And look, in the slot you deal with smarter receivers who run more in the game. So, do you like this kind of challenge or not? And you can be sure Witherspoon is showing that attitude in practice. The guy celebrates when he makes the right plays, and doesn't sit still when he doesn't. He's being a little engine of vibrancy. He's being the little engine of the vibe on the field, and that's inspiring everyone. Plus, he's ready to hit, he's willing to take the heat. He even made a nasty tackle on D. Eskridge in practice last week. Witherspoon said that even though he's a little smaller, he doesn't let anyone underestimate his power. So, do you like this style of player or not? And look, playing in the slot also brings more responsibility to the running game. Carroll explained that he has very specific assignments for the ground game at that position. So, are you hooked on this strategy or not? But there's more, Witherspoon missed a couple days of practice because of contract issues, but now he's back in full force. And he said it was fine, it was nothing personal, and that the break with the team is genuine. He's happy to be back with the guys, bro. So, are you enjoying this story? If you're into it, give that like and strengthen the channel, family. And don't forget to subscribe there to stay tuned for all the news from our Seattle Seahawks. Let's go, Seahawks Nation! A moment of interruption in the report to present a warning of importance. We would like to emphasize that if you wish to continue to be recommended by YouTube to receive the latest news, it is critical that you leave your mark of support by clicking the like button on this video. We express our gratitude in advance. Now, let's get back to the sequence of the news. 
So, fans, what is your perception of this news? Are you aligned with it, or do you have a different view? Share your opinion in the comments section. This plays a crucial role in helping our beloved team understand your feelings. Stay tuned as I will be back soon with more updates.